Hello everybody, it's Captain Thief with the April 29th Daily Dungeon. Yes, the derp. It's going to be Halls of Steel, somewhat of a hard dungeon, if I remember right, the Indomitable is there. I did yesterday's off camera, I'm sorry, I apologize. It was Elven Ninja. It actually got kind of easy toward the end, but starting off was actually pretty hard because I wasn't sure who to kill and everything threatened to mana burn me and I couldn't take on a level 2. Or at least that's how it felt. <clears throat> Looks like we're going to be an elf wizard, which is actually pretty good for this one, I think. Um, wizards are actually kind of good at attacking still, so, you know, attack boosters don't hurt. The shop scroll, meh, I'll think about it. Uh, Patch is the teddy, he's way too out there. I'm thinking about Earth Mother. The double plants won't really bother me, especially since it's something that won't affect me until I go with Earth Mother herself, so that's a thing. I can go with extra glyph, and, you know, wizards like that, because then you get as many, you know, they can hold as many glyphs as possible. But the mana boosters, man. The mana boosters. And Orb of Zot. Jeez. Some of these things are just so good. Um, I'm thinking about going with the War Garble as opposed to the Orb of Zot. No, the Orb of Zot is still pretty darn good. Especially with the three mana. Dang, okay. I'm looking like a scrub for going with this uh, easy layout. But, you know, let's do it anyway. Then again. I don't know. War Garble. I mean, Norbazat is great, don't get me wrong, but let's try and play this a little, uh, challengely. Okay, so, the War Garble also makes it so that our burning stacks don't explode too much when we, uh, strike somebody. So, that's a thing. Now, I already start off with the Burn Duraz, and that's just wonderful, if you ask me. Uh, that's a level 7 vampire down there. We're not gonna fight him just yet. I can wear this guy twice. And the second one will do six damage. Hey, bad assassin, how's it going? Um, we'll get him down to eight. And then my hit will do... Uh, I think this will work. I think this will barely work. Or he'll have one health left. He'll have one health left. Let's just try it. Maybe we can region fight him. In our own weird way. Alright, so can I grab just two to burn him? Yeah, okay. The way that worked, though, was that the burn actually prevented some of his region. So... <laughs> That, that's how that worked. And, you know, I'm glad I tried it out. I really don't like illusions. I really don't like illusions. Halls of Steel. Well, it's not vicious steel. So that must mean that we're going to find a... Uh, what do you call it? Um, that wonderful thing that I like so much. Tell you what. Um, he's got two stacks of burning on him now since Wizard puts on twice as much of that. So now we're just going to fill up on magic. Um, I'm going to have to grab two squares. I'm so, so sorry. And we're just going to burn him twice a Rooney. And I don't mind getting mad burn. Whatever. Because I leveled up and fixed it. That's why. So now can we take on level four? Well, we can't live through a hit. So I'm thinking, no, not really. All right, let's just keep moving. I don't like the curse, but we all got to push the envelope sometimes. Curse is actually pretty bad for here. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and smack that guy. Okay, cool. Uh, curse is pretty bad for here because if we find that orb of lucery, that's what it's called, um, guess what? We're not able to really utilize it to its fullest because we'll be cursed. Agnostic's caller. I haven't really found enough uh, altars to really make that work. Um, we can hold as many of these things as we want. Almost. I might as well just go ahead and sidestep now. I'm a wall. Sounds like a pretty darn good idea, too. Um, let's go ahead and do that. And now we can take a hit from somebody. Oh, plate mail. Plate mail's interesting. Quite interesting. But is it interesting enough? Okay, so... I don't have first strike or anything. I'm thinking. I can burn him twice, yes. In fact, I can get a whole bunch of burn stacks on him, so I can get up to four. So really, my burn durazes, burn durazes are actually doing 12 per. So I can take off 24, leaves him 22. Uh, if I just had a bit more health, they have the same amount of health, right? Yeah, if I had a bit more health, if I had a bit more health, uh, well, speak of the pendant of health, and you know what? I'm just going to buy it because reasons. 
Okay, and that does it. I should be able to take this guy on now. Yeah, okay. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and smack, and smack, and burn, and burn, and yeah, okay. Good. Very good. That took off my death protection, but you know what? It was worth it to see its smiling face. If I had the Orb of Lucery, that would have been a much easier fight, by the way. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Um... My burn, burn should be doing a bit more now. Yeah, I, I, I think I can take this guy on. So yeah, that, was, that wasn't too hard. He was just a level 4 and stuff. Uh, the illusions though, guys. They have a high enough health to really bother me. Uh, what's this glyph? Oh, get in there. Man, good glyphs. Maybe we'll find good Glenric too. Uh, barely living through this one. And, and the orb of, or uh, the uh, pendant of health is not you know, exactly making the difference anymore. I'm just gonna explore a little. Maybe find the Orb of Lucery and yet, you know, totally not. Found her cool. Found her cool. The Balanced Dagger. Is there a whole bunch of level 3s around here? There's this level 3. And I could burn him twice and then get in there. Yeah, okay. You know, I might just take up your offer on that, Mr. Balanced Dagger. Boom, boom, get in there, boom. Sweet. And we'll just take that off. And then we'll smack this guy. Which, you know, burned his uh, burn stack and took off another death protection, which is, might I just suggest, beautiful. And I, I'm loving these animated armors for that reason. Though I should probably be saving these. Uh, he's actually pretty close to dead. Let's just proc a, uh, a get in there and... Yeah, finish him off. Okay. Okay. So as I said, I should probably be saving popcorn for the... Uh, what's his name? The Indominator's... The D Indominator fight, yes. Why? Because he's actually pretty darn tough. Alright, this guy has physical resist. But I can get three physical hits in on him. Uh, for 21 apiece. That's uh, 63 damage. As long as I can make up the difference in two burns. 63 minus that is 45. How much are we doing here? Not enough. <laughs> Not nearly enough. So, yeah, I'm thinking at level 7, while tempting, especially at this level, uh, it's just not in the cards without drinking a potion or something. Maybe a level 6. Yeah, totally. Totally, totally, totally. And then, boom. Okay, cool. I like taking on two higher level things. Let's just go ahead and get that out of the way. And Battle Mage Ring, oh man. You know, that's actually a pretty good get because, you know, I, I'm actually burning a whole bunch of things. That's like my main method of attack, even though I'm trying to be a hybrid wizard. So boom to boom. I'm doing twenty-six per hit now, so three. I, I'm saying I take one hit, I take a death protection hit, and then I take a get in there. The get in there has to finish him off. Um, 26 times 3, guys. What is that? 78? Yeah, so just 30. Can I do that with two burns? Definitely. Okay, well, we'll do that then. Boom. Boom. Burn. Burn. Get in there. That's it. This is the important part. Boom. Three curses. That's actually pretty darn bad, but... I mean... It was only level 7 I could see. Oh. Well, it was the only level 7 I could see. That Let's put it that way. Oh, now we're in 3 burn territory. That's my fancy way of saying we can burn th things 3 times without using any mana or whatever. So you... Here's what we'll do. We'll just proc the uh, get in there. And then bam, 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 boom. Wow. This is turning out to be a very fast level. Um... Orb of Lucery is great. Like I said, though, it won't affect us because we're cursed twice. Um, hang on. I wonder how much this guy will take. One, two, three burns. And then a hit. How much are my burns doing? Well, let's not think about that too much. Um, <clears throat> let's, just, let's just try it out. I know, it's better to math than to death, but let's just death anyway. I don't even know what death means, so don't, don't 
Don't bother me. Okay, he's going to mana burn me. And that's okay. I'm, it's not like I'm with Mistar or anything. In fact, I'm with nobody. I'll just do it this way. And then barely win. Cool. Halfway through level 6 already. They grow up so fast. He was on top of a store, wasn't he? I think he was. Okay, like I said, I'm trying to leave as many low levels as possible. And I'd also like to find the boss as soon as I can. Oh, there we go. Taste the edge of my blade, jerk. Okay. I'm really not a fan of Timothy Longdoll. Also, why does it say poisonous one? As far as I'm concerned, if I'm poisoned, I'm poisoned. My poison doesn't come off in time like it does on enemies. So let me think here. Um, wow. He's got actually a lot of health to go through. This was this is going to be a, a tough one. Um, and he doesn't do magic damage either, so the orb illusory is not going to help. Tell you what I can do though. Three health per level, I think. And that means right now it's costing 18, which means I am able to spend four times or get 12 men out of it. Not bad on the math there, Captain, but uh, what does that mean ultimately? Well, what it means is I can burn him three times, then two more times, then get in there. Um, get in there, well, yeah. Yeah, the get in there will actually be kind of, okay, wait. Uh, this is, this is a tough one. So, we're looking at 200 damage to do with burns, and I'm not doing that with just five burns, guys. Not yet. Not yet. Okay, well, we'll just keep on leveling up, especially since we have such good choices like these. Let's just go ahead and proc that now. Burn, burn, burn. What did you learn? That that guy was easy to kill? That's what I learned. Okay. So, I guess we'll explore a bit more. The bosses do se seem to be around this area. Not that they follow any sort of rule like that, just, just having some fun here. A level 8 animate armor, I gotta say, that's gonna take a ton of resources and is probably a bad idea to fight. Let's do it. Okay, so, actually, no. I mean, even when I get him down to, I don't know, six death protections left, he's going to be, he's still going to probably one-shot me. No, he's not going to be able to one-shot me. But dang, if it isn't annoying, I, I'm going to end up eating a lot of popcorn, putting burns on him, taking him off and stuff. Oh, maybe this Orb of Lucery will sweeten the deal. It did sweeten the deal a bit. Let's go and grab this. We'll maybe try and region fight him. Oh, cool. A dodge from all those get in -deers. And they say that wouldn't pay off. Okay. So, what do we hit? Um, I can't, I'm not a fan of illusions, so, yeah, I'm, I'm doing that. Uh, taking off his health gradually. Let's just uh, burn off some more, I guess. I don't know. It just seemed like the thing to do. And he's still poisoned. That's great. It's like I'm a ninja. And he's still got one death protection left. I don't want to lose my death protection just yet. So we'll do that. And then we'll burn him. But we have an extra burn. So here's what I'm thinking about doing. Who would benefit who would benefit me if I burn him? Probably Timothy. Oh, that, that did it. Okay. Well, I guess I wasn't able to get an extra burn in on Timothy, but oh well. Um so I did that. That doesn't mean I have to go through with this whole thing, especially since Timothy's pretty darn hard, if you ask me. So, I definitely don't want to get mana burned by smacking him. And by the way, this just ended up costing 3 times 7 or 21, so I'm still at the, the 4 range of being able to use blood to power, so... Yeah, it's, it's still only 5 burns on him. So, 5 burns. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. It's close. It's dang close. I'd have to use some potions. And I, I'm probably going to end up using potions, let's be honest. Uh, there's a level 7 down there, but you know what? I don't care. Let's fight the Tomothy. I promised everybody I would. And then boom. 
And I drink one. Just one. Get in there. Boom. Alright, there we go. Okay, we can sell this. Get 25 gold instantly. Which means we have our pick of the crop of uh, things to buy. Like the battle majoring. I don't know if the battle majoring is that great though. I mean, it's pretty darn good, don't get me wrong. But I don't know if it's worth buying. Um, I'm poisoned in everything. <laughs> and also, am I mana burned? No, I, I drink a potion to take care of that. I hate to do this, but I'm going to drink a potion just to cure <laughs> poison. And let's uh, go down here. Level 9. The fire heart is actually pretty darn good for my build. We're going to do it. It uses mana to heal me, but I'm going to fill it up so darn fast that your head will spin, yes. Um, I'm thinking that he's got to be this direction, no? Um, I am a little confused on where he could be then. Seriously. Where is he? Is he in the middle? No, he isn't. I'm just going to un unwind all the this darkness, though. For fun and profit. Um, burn. Burn, get in there. Okay, we got a level up catapult ready to go. So where is he? I must know. Oh, this is tough. I mean, did, did they change this dungeon a little bit? So that maybe he's down in the sub-dungeon. Uh, I kind of do feel like fighting this guy. But first, something you can do is, you know, fill up on stuff here. Yeah, okay, cool. First strike's not going to help me, but death protection will. So I'm going to... It doesn't matter if I smack or burn first, by the way. This will work either way. Um, Oh, and I might as well turn another guy to stone. Yep, that used some mana, I know. And now I need one more square, but there's no one squares there. There's a one square. Okay. Let's fight this guy for reals. Smack. Smack. I mean, let's be honest. I, I'm going to have to smack him again. And then finish him off. Level up. Hooray. Level 8. Doing pretty okay. Okay. I think, actually, I can tell he's probably right down here, if you can see my cursor. Because... There's something red underneath this steel golem. At least that's what I'm thinking anyway. Uh, let's go down here again. And fill up on magic a little recklessly. Touching that altar or whatever is going to make him pop out. Or some vampire pop out. So smack, smack. How much is three burns going to do? Well, I, can, I can hit him three times. So as long as... As long as you love me. Uh, yeah, this will work. Yeah, okay, there we go. Found him. Jeez, they kind of hit him a little hidden away this time. He doesn't hit that hard, though. Which is good news for the home team. Um, it couldn't hurt to heal up a little. And get our death protection back? We're gonna need a little more health than that, Captain. A little more health than that. Um... One squares. Two square. Yeah. And Philip. And Michael. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop it. So, let's see. I'm cursed. It would behoove me to remove that curse. But at the same time, he's got ten stacks of death protection, so, you know, I want to save some popcorn for destroying his stuff. Still, let's kill this goblin. And kill. Oh, we have two more, so let's let's not focus too much on EXP. And also be careful about killing the Steel Golem because he'll curse us when he dies because he's a jerk like that. And this goblin. Okay, cool, excellent. Let's go back down here, fill up, and now we can begin. And I'm not even using an altar or anything. I'm being kind of faithless, actually. Thanks to dodge. And then we'll um, burn him. That took off one stack. And now we just smack somebody else. Somebody who won't hit too hard, like this guy. And then we burn him again. And then we smack that guy again to, you know, do the thing. 
And then we burn him again, which is, you know, getting kind of excellent. <clears throat> now I don't really care about getting cursed. As long as I level. And yeah, he's doing, you know, full damage now, but I don't care. Boom. There we go. Daily done. Um, I can't, I don't have any tools with which to dig through here. Binlor's not even here for me to have that option. Um, so this one's pretty much done. I might as well see how hard the, uh, vampire, oh, okay, he's equal level. And he actually hits pretty darn hard. Okay, I mean, sure, I'll, I'll deal with it. Um, real quick though, let's read this. Yeah, yeah, okay, it always says the same thing. Boom, boom, boom. Burn, burn. Where, why did that show up? I don't even know. Uh, I'm gonna smack him, get in there and smack him. Okay, and that lets us leave. Otherwise, the exit's blocked. There's really no point coming down here when you think about it, except for EXP and the darkness. And you can get the darkness without fighting him, so... So, you know, do what you want. Okay. Faithless run. Green Earth Mother would have made this really easy. I could have just used a whole bunch of plantation slash clearances, and that would have been just fine. I kind of took my time, though. So I'm probably, like, what, 25th again? I was 24th yesterday. That, that seems to be the uh, pattern. Captain's always in the mid-20s. Captain's in his mid-20s. No, he's actually getting in his late-20s these days. He's 12th. Captain Thief is 12th. Also, there's uh, somebody on the YouTube channel can't remember his name off the top of my head but um, yeah he he does this too so maybe he'll be up here um, probably in the upper levels let's be honest because you know I come up with new ideas but other people are much better at them yes uh, friends maybe he's in my friends list because I told him to add me on Steam nobody has attempted to say okay okay that's fine it only came out two hours ago this has been Captain Thief playing the April 29th derp. I know it says 28th, but it's really the 29th because it's going to be the 29th in five hours over here anyway. So, yeah, that's how it is. Diligence reward. You got 750 gold for trying your dailies. Trying. Trying. Excuse me. I beat that stuff. I don't know why it gave it to me now and not earlier. I, I had five derps left. Whatever, I'm fine with it. I like gold. I need gold to upgrade stuff. And I need tons of gold to get any upgrades. I think I'm going to wait on the triple quest until I get all the upgrades. No, that's going to be a long time. We'll see. The triple quests are hard. I mean, I, ne I need all of the Skullgrim help to uh, get through those. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been Captain Thief playing Desktop Dungeons. I'll see you tomorrow with yet another daily. Bye.